Mm, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. I'm just going to tweet out, <clears throat> excuse me.
right, it looks like everything's in place. I'm gonna go ahead and start the stream. Well, not start the stream. Start the game. Close out as much stuff as I possibly can. The game is pretty unstable, it feels. Um, like my only real complaint about it. It's pretty fun otherwise. I just be feeling bad because I feel like I'm I'm focusing more on like my stream and whether the game is like working or not than the actual story. Um and it's kinda sad. It's it's a little annoying more than sad, actually. Um, but I also know that I could easily just like rewatch some of the cutscenes, but I was just like, damn, bro. Every time I'm playing the game, I'm like, please don't crash. Like that's all I really care about. Uh, let me just make sure my displays aren't on HDR. Everything is regular, regular. It looks like it's. <clears throat> Async is on though. I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. I do have a 40 series. I got a 4080 to be specific. I think I'm gonna just put it in like performance mode. Yeah. And like, I don't even know if that's like a, all I, all I care about, to be honest, this is what I really care about. I hope that Monster Hunter is not held back by the same problems when it drops. Like that's my, that's my biggest concern. What's up with you, Charles? <clears throat> also, it says take the arch staff to the Greatsword Guild. I'm not going to hold you. I thought I picked it up. I swear I had it in my inventory. I've been doing a little bit of offline grinding. Not that much late for work. I feel that. This might contain useful also, information. I don't look then. I don't know why. I don't know why Ash from League of Legends um has no health. Like, what is she doing? What is she doing? Yo, I was fighting these harpies in a watchtower, bro. They murdered us multiple times. They kept picking us up and dropping us off. That shit was bananas. I was so pissed. I'm like that little pickup move. It's more annoying than anything else. Nah, it, it's it's pretty good. It's a, it was a the tech the tech was 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 solid. It was some solid tech. I cannot understand this city. The only other thing I would like is if the game could zoom out just a smidge more. Morning, Martino. Tell us. Good tidings, sir. How fares your retrieval of those plundered weapons? Will that be all then? Let me see. What else can I tell you of our guild? Always a pleasure. Good tidings, sir. How fares your retrieval of those? Like, did I not pick these swords up, bro? I swear to God, I did. Will that be all then? Let me see. What else can I do? For also, if you notice, we are also streaming on Twitter. Why? Just cuz. Thank you. But you're absolutely right. This is not much of a difference. 
Where is the inn? It's dark as shit in here. Well, you will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey. Sure, I'll rest. We must rest. I have to rest because Ash from League of Legends has no health. Good morrow, everyone. Come, we've much to be getting on with. Two thousand GP. And Gucci Mage, shout out to Gucci Mage, actually super clutch. So it's me, Zangief, Ash from League of Legends, and uh, Gucci Mage. It says, bring the weapons you've acquired. You see what I'm saying? Like, found the armor, goblin layer, found an art staff, found a great sword. Where is it? Who has it? And I look at my inventory. Like, nobody has it. My biggest fear, my biggest fear is that somebody had it in their inventory. Okay, so he has it. No, their name is just Ash, but it's very obvious. But it's, it's, it's Ash from League of Legends, because that's who it is. Wooden staff. This is the thing I'm talking about, but I don't know where the art staff is. My biggest fear was that somebody, like... Uh, what's the word for it? I gave it to somebody and they didn't and they took it with them like Is that how the pawn system works can they can they take things that are left in their inventory? I hope not It goes to storage ah Thank you. Good you time, see, that's sir. what it is. How fares your retrieval of? Will that be all then? Do you Let have my? See. How do I access my storage? What else can I tell you about? Do come again. First things first, though. Zangief. Give me the sword. Good tidings, sir. How fares your retrieval of those plundered weapons? Ah, I see. you may now change your vocation to warrior. If you would prefer to register a sorcerer, you What's the storage John look like? I'm so like I'm so lost in this game. But in a good way. Pawn guild. User seats. No, I know. I came here to sell some stuff and to put stuff into storage. This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. Yeah, I was oh, pretty. Excellent find. You were cooked Saturday, which I was doing Saturday. Tell the court. How do I act? I'm actually gonna just Google it. Why am I why am I walking around like I don't have technology? What should I get him? Ah, the innkeeper. When you're the last thing that's going to convince me to play this game, I've been trying to hold off. Might you consider lightening your pack, Master? If you feel overburdened, mayhap I could carry some things for you. Tell them to get the game. I think, I think you would probably like it, Martino. I mean, like, okay, so how do you feel about games like... 
what's i guess actually a better question the best question what's stopping you from getting the game outside of money if it's finances then the answer is no don't get the game if it's like i just don't know if i'll like it then we can talk about that organized storage deposit all right brother what are we depositing here uh, let's see also my rb button busted bro it's kind of whack like this super responsive rb comes and goes and it sucks because i'm trying to sometimes i'll be trying to throw things and it'll just throw it because my rb button is broke um i think i could give i could think i could put all these away Oh, watching me play was the final day of the coffin. Hey, you know. Yeah, man. And it sucks because this is an elite controller. This is like the second generation elite controller. So I was, uh, what, psh, bro, I'm pretty pissed about it. I feel like these are fine. I may end up giving these away, but like. Oh, yeah, put those copper ores away, my boy. But the in all. I was playing online, I was not cooperating. I hate that for you. Not finances. It's just me being afraid I don't got enough time to dedicate as much as I want to. So, like, when I was... When I, I was going to say when I was broke. So, as a broke man, currently... Um, labor trousers. Interesting. I still have a lot of stuff in my thing. Oh, let me withdraw the, the staff, though. Much obliged. So what I like to do is I kind of have to, I, I kind of like take inventory. I take inventory of the games that I play. So first things first, you got to ask yourself, what games are you playing right now? What games are you addicted to? Right. Like right now, the games that I'm playing are... How this isn't stealing. Uh, the games that I'm addicted to right now are... I don't want to say League because I'm not really addicted to League. I haven't really played that game in a minute. But Tekken. Tekken is one of them. Um, like a Dragon. And I say this because I play it off stream too. Let us press on with our next objective. Gucci Mage. On to the nearest location. Lead us. The soldiers delivering freight were last despite near Vermin's eastern edge. That's not far from here. I will say this game probably has some of the best uh, NPCs. They're not always the best, but like just making them useful. The to make our journey easier. Fewer monsters are to be found on the main road. But boy there, friend. All I ask is that you hear my request. My thanks, sir. As to the matter at hand, it 
concerns my ox cart business. I've been holding off service on a the only thing I don't like is I gotta press A every time they talk. Like, just do it automatically. Are you prepared to start making trip only trouble is there are still more. That's where you come in. See, I've got, I'd like you to accompany the cart in my stead and see to it that the letter reaches its recipient. What say you, friend? I already have so many quests, though. <laughs> Now, the carts only depart at certain hours of the day. And mind you, don't forget to pay your way before you board. That's standard practice. And I would each cart travels with an escort of trained soldiers, see? In case it encounters any monsters out. So anyone thinking of riding for free will have to take the issue up with them. But enough of my lecturing. Just make sure that letter gets to Sir Lennart. Then come. Oh, and I'll pay your fare this time, seeing as you're doing me a favor and all. Come find me when you've delivered that letter. I'll be. We need only deliver it to the intended recipient. Hey, Lex. Um, alright, really, it's just Tekken Hell Diver. That's most of what I've been playing. Yeah, you no, you definitely need a single player game. I'm not gonna hold you because like I be playing Hell Divers, but I be playing Hell Divers by myself, and I'd be like, damn. It's not that it's boring. It's just it's just not fun by yourself. Oh, I went. I've been to Mel. Oh, say less. We out. This ox cart's bad. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. I got the bread for you. How much did he give me? My God. This ox cart's bound. Um, a ladder here. We ought to so here's the thing, right? And I'm, I'm probably gonna use the ox cart just to straight up talk. But is he leaving? Are we out? It looks like we might be out. But anyways. So here's the thing i always like to have like so right now my competitive game is tekken that's the game that i play when i'm like when i have like the the urge to to succeed right when i have the urge to work to to compete i have hell divers as like my mindless shooter but i only really play by myself so i don't get too much mileage out of it like i'll play a run or two like i'm i'll maybe we'll do like two medium missions and i'll hop off i hate playing with randoms so i don't really play with randoms i literally just play by myself um and then i'm trying to think of any other games that i play or my brother sometimes will be on so i'll like slide through to one of his missions just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients no harm in picking a few is a fast travel or lack of there been an issue for you so far no nah, look like i'm on this ox cart right now right i'm doing this just so i can talk to you guys but if i really wanted to Of course, there's a raid right now, so you know I gotta get up and I gotta box. There we go. So like, you know, that was, th this is the fast travel. Like, you get on the ox cart. You can either take a nap or you can just watch it happen. Like, I'm not, I'm not a big, I'm not a big, uh, honestly, like, you want to know what has really good fast travel? Like, and I say this all the time and I wish more games used it. Like, I like the, like a dragon fast travel and by fast travel i mean like the taxis are cool but i like having a little the segue that just does the, the the traversal for me you know i loved red dead redemptions like if you put it in cinematic mode and just held a 
your horse would just go th like i don't know if you if y'all played it but like i'm sure y'all played it but i don't know if y'all knew this i found it out my boy told me about it if you put red dead redemption 2 in cinematic mode and held a on your horse the horse just goes to the same path that you had marked out like it's pretty it's pretty ch chill like you're just on your phone i like it because i'm not somebody who has the luxury of like i can lock the world out i can like play the game and not have to worry about a single thing right i'm on my phone i'm texting people back i'm checking things up you know what i'm saying like i'm 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 engaged in other things while i play video games so like i don't mind the horse riding it's uh, like i don't mind the horse going on its own or doing the little ox cart shit because like this is chill if i want to go just go go to sleep and you wake up and you're just like like oh look we're in mel sick like it's not that big a deal um i genuinely feel like and maybe this is me being a bit of a of a of an old head i guess like i don't know what to, de to describe it um those are my scroll you know what i'm saying like i go on twitter i check instagram like you know what i'm saying there's not a moment when i'm playing video we games at night where the homies ain't Mayhem, like throwing funny shit in the twitter journey. group chat like that shit is hilarious or check up on my daughter you know what i'm saying like there's there's other things around so i don't really care we're we've gotten to a point in gaming discourse where people only know how to bitch um i think that's really what it comes down to because i think there's a valid conversation to be had about the microtransactions in this game but the the fucking length at which is that you norbert who's norbert oh, fie wait listen would you be willing to search for my brother oh my god the brave fool said he was going to look for herbs i'll go and search for him myself only I, I, i'm not afraid of monsters which would hardly help anything if i were to run in there unprepared and get myself hurt now would so i thought mayhap you'd go in my place oh my god you look like please sir i worry if many i'll i'll look for you brother. into the forest and turn when you reach the tree ah, this won't work with my brother and i are the only ones who use that path to my knowledge i suppose there's only one thing for it i'll have to show you the way just be alert i'll need you to watch over me keep right let us make haste that no life may be lost on our account don't don't leave sir don't leave i'm looking for the guy i have to give this letter to we are not leaving this place until i can give this to make the mail delivery letter to lenart okay i don't even and i'm like and maybe this is a hot take i don't even care that they did it after the release window to be quite honest excellent find the analogy i used in uh the analogy are you lenart say have I not her the analogy i used on twitter encapsulates how i feel about it perfectly um when i went i went to this pizza shop actually funny enough where the fuck is this bitch lenart um when i went to this pizza shop on saturday bro my one of my favorite pizza shops i will say this i will say this it is expensive because every topping i wanted to add onto the onto the za was a full dollar we have found a material like i was like god damn but great ingredients personal pizza felt like a straight up medium you know what i'm saying solid pizza spot i only go there like once oh once a year because that shit's expensive but probably one of my favorite za spots they got the vegan cheese they got the regular cheese they be hooking it up so when i was in there the the reason i don't really care too much about the microtransactions is because like when i order pizza from this spot they give me the appropriate amount of za you know what i'm saying they gave me the appropriate amount of pepperoni the appropriate amount feels like pizza is way more expensive yo bro it is fucking absurdly expensive these days but they give me the right amount of pepperoni i never have to ask for extra i never have to ask for them to do anything you know i'm just like yo give me the thank god we found it yeah we found her house she's not in the fucking crib and she don't got a mattress this bitch is living awful anyways where was i we are at her house but she is not home the fuck is nobody got cribs in this yo this place is awful 
I hope it's the settings that I have on. I hope performance mode deletes mattresses because this is absurd. <laughs> Motherfuckers really ain't got no mat. I'm about to turn this shit on to quality mode just to see if they put a mattress in this bitch. Yeah, there. Where is... I'm in her house, bro. She's not here. I really fucking hate it here. Like, this is her crib. Why are you not home? I got a letter for you. This is so annoying. I gotta go help this man find his brother. We are none of us alike in vocation. Our respective abilities are unique as well. I see it as a glad thing. What brings you here? Bro, where is... Where is Lenart? But anyways, let me get... You, nah, you see, they got mattresses. Lenart lives like a fucking savage. Are you Lenart? Whatever it is, I'll have to hear it another time. Are you Lenart? I'm always willing to lend a helping hand. Are you Lenart? Yes? Is there something I can do for you? Are you Lenart? Some time passed. I encountered an elf. Thief class? Yes, sir. Is Lenart a dude? Are you Lenart? What might you need? Lenart. The other day I espied an Don't give a fuck. Mind, yeah. I have time for a citizen in need. I need Lenart. We might go. <laughs> Is this your card? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. We're gonna save his brother. We're gonna be back. Alright, let's go. This man said I gotta work to put bread on the table. I hear him. Anyways. Lead the way, sir. At once, master. What am I to do with my lord? Typical of your type. That's funny as shit. That's funny as shit. What was I going to say? Anyways, back to the pizza analogy. So I get, I 100% get the whole like, yo, it's, it is nasty for them to do that to them, for them to be like, yo, we're putting this shit up after everything is said and done. But this game, let me restart because ADHD destroys my way of communicating. And you could tell that's that's what I was talking about the other day when I was like, yo, I need to learn how to talk better. But anyways. So the reason I use the pizza analogy for this game is because if the pizza is made well, if the pizza is made well, you don't have to ask for extra pepperoni. You don't have to ask for extra sausage. You just get the full slice with everything that you want on it. This is what I want on it. There's enough of it on it that I don't have to pay extra for it. Now, of course, if you're somebody who wants extra pepperoni, more pepperoni than necessary, some would say, you pay the extra bread. I understand that. Like, that's just that. I understand them putting that shit up there. You're welcome to take what it's you nasty microtransaction because it's really just shit you get in game. And it's not like a lot. I'm, from my understanding, it's not like the shit in this game is finite either. This is a good spot. Let's stop here a moment. You know what I'm saying? I've camped here with my brother many a time. If you're somebody who's like, yo, I want to, I want to have as much X Y Z as possible, and I don't really care about spending money on it, go for it. I think it's valid to criticize it, but I think like they're making this shit into something crazy. Shall I escort you there, master? You mean to tell me extra extra toppings are just food microtransactions? Absolutely. It's quite literally extra, extra, whatchamacallum. Like, adding extra pepperoni is a food microtransaction. And you got to look at it that way. Because that way, now you're thinking to yourself, do I need that extra pepperoni? Not really, man. I'm going to just save my extra dollar. But if you want it and you got it, why not? You know what I'm saying? It makes sense. So, like, when I see this game and you're telling me, like, yo, they made it so that you got to pay real money to get extra whatever, I don't really care because I know that pe the people who've played this game said it's not necessary. None of it is really necessary. So, I'm like, whatever about it. If I was a reviewer, I wouldn't really include it in my review either. I would note it, but, like, if I thought this game was a 10 out of 10, the microtransactions would not cut into that because it's not, it's not invasive. It's not, like overwatch making you do so much just to move up in the battle pass when somebody can just pay for it for free you know what i'm saying
So like, I'm not a big fan. Cause like, if you've played Devil May Cry Five, if you were on that Steam page for Devil May Cry Five, you've seen that you could buy red orbs or whatever, like the the red orbs that's the currency in the game. And you're like, what's the point of that? We ought press on. I thought you wanted to take a rest, brother. I can't proceed no further. Are we resting? I gotta use my camp though. Oh, I gotta give this letter to Margaret right now. God damn it. It's a timed one. I'm sorry, brother. I gotta be back. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. We did not even get far from the town. We gotta find Margaret. I didn't know it was a timed thing. I can't I can't afford to take a nap right now, my man. Also, quests in this game are timed, so they're not like time timed wise, but it's more like, yo, if you don't do this within a couple days, it's it's a bad vibe. I try to knock out those quests as soon as I get them. I'm not trying to find somebody's brother. I should never talk to his ass. I should just walk right past him. Damn, Fortnite really was the first game with the microtransaction. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. Uh, it's the first popular one, the first mainline one, you know, like the first one we all recognized, but it wasn't because if I'm not mistaken, um, I think it was another, I think it was like H1Z1 or like PUBG or something like that. It was one of those bad boys. Is there a Lenart around here? I'm about to just talk to literally everybody. I need a Lenart. I trust you're bothering me for a reason. Bro, you're annoying. Shut up. Why is she not home, bro? You know how much easier this would have been if she was home or if they were home? I'm always willing to lend a helping hand. Oh, I can't complain. I can. If you've not to say, I'd best be going. We're looking up where Leonard is. I can't do this. Oh shit, Lenart's a dude. Lenart's a dude. I thought Lenart was I saw this little thingy on the right side, the little face, and I thought Lenart was a woman. Lenart's a, a man. I think I know exactly what it looks like. Yeah, the horse armor. Or um there was so much random DLC back in the day too. That's why people like when people are like shocked about this, I'm like, it's not, it's nothing crazy. There's actually a video that I watched about Yakuza. And they were like, if you bought the Yakuza games when they released, like you would actually be surprised. This, this is Lenart. What can I do for you? This is Lenart. This whole time we were looking for a woman. But also Lenart, go the fuck home. Lady Margaret, you say? She's a kindly sort, I must say. Our results are awaited. What say Amazing. Report? We can make the report later. But anyways, but anyways, anyways, back to back to what we were talking about. Back to what we were talking about. That's that's the theme of today. Back what we were talking about. So I can't. So that's the thing. So Tino, everybody but Zangief. Everybody but Zangief is not my character. In this game, you make a pawn. I think you could, you might be able to make more than one pawn, but I made a pawn and like all these other dudes like Ash and Gucci Mage, these are other players' pawns that just show up in the world and they'll be like, yo, like when you're not playing, your pawn will go and, and like help other people. So like Zangief, my Zangief will, will walk around town and if so, and he finds like a player, like he might walk around your town, for example. If he... If he finds you, he'll walk up to you and be like, yo, do you need a do you need a, a soldier? 
And if you're like, yeah, he'll join the team and he'll fight with you. And if you find somebody who's stronger, you can be like, yo, Zangief, deuces, and he'll leave. I think you can also find your friend's pawns, too. There's, like, uh, these rifts where, like, they let you... You open it up and it shows you all these pawns. And, like, if your friend has one, you can easily take them. I might have to go take a smash in a second. I'm not going to lie to you. This coffee is fighting back. This seems a decent spot for a campsite. Surely a rest can wait till after we've examined our surroundings. Let me make sure I have the right quest on. Yeah, I think it's interesting. Honestly, I think this game is really, really interesting. Like, if you're looking for a single player experience and action -y, <laughs> My pawn glazing somebody else. Yeah, like, you can do a lot of cool shit, too. Like... You can pick people up. Goodbye. Bro, it's mad funny. Well done, Master. Of course, of course. Thank you, Ash from League of Legends. And if you're playing it on PS5, you're going to have a way better time than the people on PC. Because the only complaints I have about this game, like, I know about the microtransactions. The only complaint I have about this game is quite literally the fact that it is just poorly optimized on pc because even again the microtransactions i just don't really care too much because like just ignore them like just ignore them the graphics to me are fine could it could it be prettier maybe but like i don't really care too much about graphics hear me? Please. oh he's in his, he's in his ass whooped You go look at grass in real life exactly like some people don't really like the graphics i play like a dragon games graphics is not my priority i thought i was done for and i don't like that they don't just continuously talk i hate that i have to press a but that's a nitpick that's very much a nitpick thanks ian save your thanks norbert i'm your brother and i ought have come sooner from where I'm standing, all that matters is that you made it in time. Anyway, I'm eager to be rid of this place. Let's return to the village, shall we? And my man wanted to take a rest, bro. He was like, yo, let's take a nap. Brother, we don't got time. The sooner the better. I've got to deliver these medicinal It's pretty fun. People who need it's, not the, it's not crazy, like, combos yeah, like DMC. But it's like, you know, tap square if you want to be brainless. But you also have, like, different abilities that you use your stamina. Like my, I like, I love ensnare because like as a thief, I don't have no lock on. No, no lock on is a little annoying, especially because I like to use, I have my eyesight. I feel like it's awful. So I like to use lock on to identify if there's any monsters left. And sometimes I'll be like, okay, is that everybody? And then I'll see my pawn fighting somebody over there. And I'm like, oh damn, I didn't even peep. Other worlds, I came to know of a treasure chest in this area. A chance you'd like to see it. So Norbert has been found, and none the worse for wear. 
Let us return him to Melv at once. Pray, allow me to show you the way. All right. So, the coffee is one. I'm sorry, y'all. I truly am. I really am. But I cannot fight it any longer. But no lock on is a little annoying, but it's also not to me again. It's not game breaking because Oh, my back. Uh, it's not awful. It, I wish they did have better. I wish it did have a lock on, but mm, or like an accessibility option to outline enemies because I just really can't. Be, I, sometimes I really don't know what's what because as you tell, like the, the colors aren't crazy in this game. Uh, oh, excuse me. But the combat is fun. The story is pretty interesting. Um, and we'll talk, we'll, we'll talk more about when I get back. I'm over here trying to like delay the inevitable. I'm trying to find a video to put on. I feel like I should put that in my stream, in my stream, like about me section. Like, yo, understand the first hour or two, there will be a bathroom break and it will be me taking said bathroom break. This is like after the game crashed for me. Yeah, the game the game crashed my computer actually. That's what happened there. But then we got a good hour or so in. Alright. I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll be back. I wonder why my display capture isn't working. There we go. That's weird. All right. No, 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 no. I'm saying last. I streamed on Saturday. I was streaming it on Saturday. My game crashed. But I'll be back. I'll be back.
Tell me to be able to avoid flames and then use a flamethrower on me. Like, what's going on here? That was a setup. Thank you, I'm so sorry. I really just cracked him in the head with a, with a box. Back, we're back, we're back. I'm just now noticing the color on the screen. It looks different from what I see. But I think I was also trying to play this in HDR. Anyways. Excuse me. Excuse me. We're back, we're back. Alright. Um... Before we get back into it, first things first, if you don't already follow the Wotaku channel on the Twitter, go ahead and follow that bad boy. Um, if you don't follow Wotaku channel on the YouTube, go ahead and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And if you don't follow me on Twitch, that's perfectly fine. <laughs> I don't really, I'm, you know. Y'all ever be seeing those Reddit stories on TikTok? 
That's my shit, bro. Alright, let's go. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. Actually, you know what? You're Let's lock it at 60, to be honest. I feel like it's a little choppy on my right side. It may not be choppy on stream, but... What's the point? Goodness. We're higher up than I thought. Take care not to fall. We ought to proceed with caution. The way my pawns were falling off of things last uh, stream was ridiculous. A fine place to harvest some ingredients. Shall we see if there's all to be found? Hope you have fun. I'm having a blast with the game, man. I really do enjoy it. I appreciate that. Who are you? I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. In battle, I shall follow your lead and prioritize support. They're level 13. I wish I could, like see my my pawns level i think we're right we're fine for right now because i don't think i've leveled up in a minute this way. back at last that I, I'm exhausted, but I can rest after I've delivered these herbs. I'll be back soon. Good on you. Just take care. You wonder why I don't follow him? So long as he's... When my brother told me he was going to fetch those herbs, I refused to join him. He said it was too dangerous. And I was right. I may have... My brother is always the one taking the initiative. While I stand there, today's misadventure showed me that the path forward is the one with fewer regrets. We managed to save Norbert. Still, I can't help but wonder if I couldn't have spared him some of the pain and fear he suffered. If I'd only steeled myself sooner. So from now on, I'm going to trust in my own instincts. Oh, absolutely, what Charles said. I let fear stop me from doing what I know to be. Is Sir Norbert safe to return? Hand spun cloak. We got a cloak. I'm still, my pack is still heavy, brother. Let me just combine some stuff. But you see how like sometimes it'll like just like skip forward. Yeah, that's not something I'm doing on purpose.
Also, me and me and Panda watched Small Soldiers yesterday. Two good deeds in one, you might say. Cause she had never seen it, bro, and she was really, she really was like, "Yo, nobody on the planet has seen this movie." And I'm like, "Bro, every," I was like, "Yo, I feel like," so I, I said, and maybe I was wrong. Of course, no, I know it was a good movie. I like the movie. She was like, she, "Cause I said, I'm like, I'm like, wow, you really never seen this?" She's like. Yeah, I've never seen this random ass movie about toys and I'm like, it's not really random. I feel like everybody's seen this movie She's like, no, not everybody has seen this movie and I'm like, bro, what are you talking like? I don't know, bro Maybe you didn't see this movie, but I feel like this went triple platinum And she was like You're the only person who's ever talked about this movie. So I asked our friend group, right? and like Nobody but my but Justin saw it and I'm like, okay, well to be fair, it's a movie like honestly, it's a movie for for boys. You know, it's a it's a dude movie. I'm not gonna sit here and lie to you. Even the romance was stupid forced. But I was like, so I was like, she I was like, I don't know, I feel like the guys have seen it. And she's like, uh wait, 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 wait. Monster colleague. That's what we were doing. Yeah, we're gonna do monster culling. Let us proceed to the next location. Shall I lead you to the location? Near so the we're watching it, right? The soldiers. I'm like, I'm like, I'll ask the guys. I'll ask the guys, cause I was like, I'm pretty sure like Trip has seen it. And she's like, ask Trip if he's seen it. Cause you 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 keep saying you're pretty sure, you're confident. Ask Trip if he's seen it. So I asked Trip in a group chat I'm with, Charles is there. We shall have to and Trip's like, I've seen, I know what it's about, but I ain't never seen it. And I was like, what the fuck? Like, that's shocking coming from Trip. Damn, damn. Thank you. Are you, right? you got stamina too, so be careful about spamming abilities like I just did. My man, get up. Over here, if you please. Damn. The homie just died. Anyways. Have you ever been swallowed up? Oh! We got a spitter! Nice. Once more. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> but yeah, she's like. <laughs> it was so funny, bro. Watching her watch that movie was so funny. By another statue. Climbing it would grant a clearer picture of our environment. Where do y'all see this at? Is that a statue? Where's the statue at? Would you mind coming over here? No, actually, you're gonna follow me. 
I think I've been here before. From provisions to crafting materials for weapons and armor. What's that got to do with me? I'm procuring goods, what with all the monsters. I sent Marcus to gather what we need, but I've just taken stock and what say you? Could I trouble you to run an errand for me? <laughs> You'll be paid, of course. Glad to hear it. Here, we ought to be somewhere and in the know, and he'll take care of the rest. Alright. North? Am I heading north? I don't think I am. Alright. I don't think the monster culling thing is a time thing, so you know, might as well. Might as well. I'm gonna get nothing ever done in this game because I'm always like see me anytime. Shall we get some rest then? Yeah, let's get some rest. I feel refreshed and ready for a new day. Come, we've much to be getting on with. Feeling rested, I trust? No, I let's spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me anytime. Let's deposit some stuff, because honestly, I feel like I don't need seven of these. I don't need like an extra seven of these. That looks better. Do come again. Thank you, sir. Let me see. Is this? Oh. Me thinks I know where to find the person you're looking for. Let's go, Gucci Mage. Might we not complete our? But yeah, that movie was pretty gas, man. She really was like. Nobody's watched that movie. I'm like, what are we talking about, bro? That movie with quadruple platinum at the crib. Then we watched um, "Now You See Me" because I didn't I didn't see that movie. Yeah, no, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. I, it was better than I was expecting it. They were trying to sleep, but like... I'll be damned. Because I'm pretty sure they would have fought me if I didn't. Interesting. Is it on Disney Plus? Ah, I'll take that. We might find a use for it. I might have to tap in. I might have to find a password. Here we are. Oh, the it's homie. Everything assembled. A job well done, if I do say so myself. Oi, did you need something? This is from Sir Jeffrey, is it? Let's have a look then. Why? He wants these as well, does he? I thought I was finished. Why should I have to do all this on my own? I've got plenty to carry as teeth. Say, and make haste. I would depart for the encampment even a moment soon. Well, go on. You know what to do. Whence might we procure such a thing? Excuse me? He wants me to do what? Proce procure some...
guitar spuds? What? Where am I even gonna find that? You're now my boss, bro. Also, if there's that many people watching on Twitter, that's bananas. But anyways, if I could find this stuff. Well, that's good to hear. I was wondering how that movie was going to do because you know how Mar you know Marvel fans, you know how they be. I could swear I've seen what's needed here amidst what we have in storage. I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon. But at least I know I am up to the challenge. We must not let down our guard. What do I even have items? Cause she's the shoddy said she we had it in storage. I'm gonna go talk to him. I'm gonna see. We might actually have it in storage. I don't feel like exploring this whole cave system. Yeah, I'll definitely tap in. I also need to catch up on like all the Star Wars TV shows. I gotta watch a uh, Killmonger in space, you know, I gotta tap into that. This is generally used as a material. Thank you. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. I think the most I've ever watched was season one of The Mandalorian. How goes it? Have you gathered everything on the list yet? Harsh, bud. Haven't you anything for? Well, you best get to it then. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. No harm in picking a few. I did have hard spud in my thing. nerds hey i was oh we also finished the first we also finished dune part one not gonna lie to you they keep that up might be better than the might be better than the wars i'm just saying i'm just saying come to think of it we might already have what we seek stored away also love that like the npcs do like that little shit right there like yo we might actually already we, we might already already have this like they're very they're super useful they're super useful <laughs> no nah, like that boy that boy was cooking I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me anytime. Harsh, bud. I feel like I literally put some away. Dry, bud. We might not. Or. Do we not have some? She has some. But I don't have any. 
that's kind of that's kind of tragic because I, I i turned it into something i did that always a pleasure Yeah, I gotta watch Dune 2 as well. Is this it? We now have all the requested items in hand. Let us deliver them to Sir Marcus. Let's go. Let's go. Big W. Big W. If you would be so kind as to follow me, I shall take you to the one you seek. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. Yeah, I gotta watch it. Speaking of Timothy Chalamet movies, I also watched Wonka. Follow me, if you would. Nah. You know? Interesting. Interesting take on, this, on the franchise. Dare I say Timothy Chalamet did a pretty solid job? I, I will say that. Would Tom Holland have been better? That's what some that's what the streets are saying. Are you coming, Master? Our We're here, Master. How goes it? Have you gathered everything on the list yet? Brilliant. I knew I could count on you. Here. Take this for your trouble. I'll be heading back to the encampment now. They'll be expecting me. Waking Shall powder. We, our results? we might as well, because I wasn't even supposed to come down here. Sir Marcus was well pleased, Master. Shall we report our success to Sir Geoffrey? Sure, why not? Certainly, Master. I can take you to this individual. We're in your hands, sir. Much obliged. Pray, follow me. We have arrived. Oi, many thanks for. As I hear it, you even assisted him in gathering us. Anyway, you've been a great help. Our efforts have seen the encampment resupplied, and Sir Geoffrey with one less care. A good deed all round. Splendid. I'll gather this. It might be of use. No, that's not the quest I want to auto thing. I want it to be the monster calling. Thank you. Let us proceed to the next location. On to the nearest location. The soldiers delivering freight were last spied near Berman's eastern edge. That's not far from here. I need to buy more better equipment though. Dead. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. Yeah. Gucci mage be throwing ice on my shit. Now that is a surprise. Oh, I was trying to give her a high five. They really just be getting grabbed and just be like, I, I guess I'm dying. They'd be like, damn, I'm gonna wait for this assailant to put me down. We 
We need me for the, the campsite. No one can defend oh. Fight back! Fight back! We may be in, we may be near an ambush. Or not. Oxcarts make for relatively safer travel. Walking everywhere is a bit far. Perhaps we might employ the services of an ox cart. Somebody must have came through here and beat him up. How far am I from this thing? <sighs> I guess we are kind of far. You truly are formidable, Arisen. Oh, there's goblins over here. Okay, cool, 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 cool. The ox car left. Oh, well. The next one. We'll find the next one. During my travels beyond the rift, I learned of a cave near here that you have yet to explore. Shall I take us there? Oh, there's the ox cart. This ox cart, I'll not take you anywhere till I've had my due. Where's Venifer? Ven Fernforth? Fernworth. Words hurt. Yeah, actually, you know what? Let's this take ox, it. I'll not take you anywhere till I've had my due. There we go. Wolves? Where's the last wolf? Barbecue chicken. Mm. 
Come to think of it, was there not another task we were to see to somewhere nearby? Yeah, we might as well. Efficiency is not the only factor worthy of consideration. Let us press on with our next objective. Ah, you've returned. Splendid. The cart reached its destination safe and sound, and from the television. Ox carts seem a convenient choice for longer. Minor hosen. I need to upgrade them because like I want to wear them because the, the pants I got on right now they're a little revealing if you could not tell you know what I'm saying but the stats are nuts the pants are crazy but the stats are even crazier so we've been rocking with the with the go-go with whatever this is there's a ladder here we ought to put it to good use were you the guy who enhances things? Welcome to Bjorn's art. And quality is what you need if you want to survive. Yeah, bro. It's tough, but it's like... They're nice pants. So before you check the price, just remember... Hope to see you again. They're still not good enough, you know what I'm saying? Uh, let me put this in my inventory then. I don't even feel like I should put them in my inventory. I think I should just sell them, but I also have mad money. Let's let's buy some some armor. Welcome to Bjorn's and quality is what you need if you want to survive. So if we check the price, just remember. This is nice. My Not enough funds. Oh, it's expensive. Just die early. Salute. <gasps> Deaths. Many thanks. I appreciate the. Our packs are heavier. Now a purse is far lighter. We've a journey to prepare for, after all. We can't afford to cut corners. <laughs> Charles said, "I'll bust it open for some good stats." And I agree. Well met. You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey when treated to the foremost.
All this stuff is on me, so I can't really put it away. Hospitality in all Vernworth. Much obliged. No, but I'm trying to keep I'm trying to keep my habits to the weekends. My vices. I've just recalled a little tidbit I heard from the locals. Regarding the Vermundian military, yes? Indeed. Tell is, there's been a shift in the chain of command. What do you want? I'm trying to see who, who, who pilots this bad boy, is it you? I'm not taking any passengers just now. Hmm. How far am I from the thing I want to go to? I'm not that far. Let's go. Let us proceed to the next location. Shall I lead you to the location nearest here, Arisen? Might as well. Delivering freight were last spied near Vermin's eastern edge. That's not far from here. But yeah, that's tough. I'm trying to keep my habits to the weekend until I get a job and then I can afford to do them whenever I want. A fine place to harvest some ingredients. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? No, nah, we're, we're good for right now. But once I get that guapage, best believe nefarious things will be afoot. What kind of a job I'm looking for? I would love like a social media manager position type vibe. Oh my, my God, he's hitting all of those. Content creator, content specialist community manager something along those something along those lines get away from the buffalo Bro, he was hitting, bro, he was throwing them tracking shits and I kept sidestepping in the wrong direction. What's up, Mac? Thank you for that. How you living, bro? Happy, I mean, I already said happy birthday to you, but how, how'd the birthday celebrations go? And you know what's funny? I feel like Max said that thinking that we weren't going to see it. Or he might have said that because we knew he knew we were going to see it. A menace, a menace either way. But if you are watching on the Twitter side, slide a follow on the Twitter. What with a canopy overhead? Stay watchful. There's no telling what might be lurking. Oh snap! A troll.
Gucci mage. Let my magic imbue your weapons with the fury of the elements. My curative magic is at your disposal. Wait right there. Speak for yourself. He's not. I'm really just on his shoulder. My man was really on there doing nothing. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> the game is going crazy. <laughs> You can grab a hold of hold while standing by him and once you have a hold of them, you can push or pull them or draw them or knock them back. Interesting. My man is my man is quite literally stuck between this tree. Yes, sir. Push up! Zanky! That was hard! That was hard! That was hard, dude. Splendid. My man Zanky jumped off at the right moment. This game is sick, dude. Building some Lego dust plants and smoking while waiting for my ADHD mess to Over kick here. in. Love that for you. Also, you people, how they gave me like a monster bone halfway through that fight. I don't need this. Which one of the Lego desk plants? I want to get a good, I want to get a camera, like a, a hand cam, so I can start building gunplas on stream. Like I want to have it so that it's like over my computer so I can like have it, but I also don't want to use my regular camera because I want to be able to have my face on it. Ash from League of Legends. Stay with me, right there. I'm saved. Thank you, Arisen. Succulent? Ooh. I started building gunplas because I was like, one, I was just into Gundam at the time. And I still am. I just need to get back into Gundam. The only issue is that anytime you put an anime on Hulu, it's very rare that I finish it. And it's just because like, 
Bro, I'm I have Hulu with the ads. Was oh, this but no, this is actually worse than than what I have. I was supposed to use this. And it's funny because this game, you be thinking like it's not um All the small shit adds up and it's a uh, it's getting a little annoying, but I gotta get a gunplay. They're not expensive either, too. And they're pretty cheap. At least according to my girlfriend. Uh double check with her on that though. Is there a way to tell what time it is? Outside of like looking at the sun? Time, time, time. No? Is there no way of telling what time uh, it is? I'll take that. We might find a use for it. Not sure, right? Right? I feel like that should be a thing, though, because it gets late. How to tell time in... Oh, here we go. Oh, wait. Okay, so, Charles, this is how you tell time. I found out. This ring right here. The ring. You see how, like, the map has, like, that ring of the sun? It's moving towards the left. So, like, it's the sun is setting and it's going to be nighttime soon. That's how you tell what time it is. That's very subtle, but that's also really sick. <laughs> I did not know that. I just looked it up. That's what they said. We might just set up camp just to... If we can set up camp. There we go. I see our goal has changed. I would not presume to direct our course, but do let me know if you require a guide. Ugh. I think them cutting, I think them cooking a real steak IRL is the funniest thing in the world. Like, they really switched to an IRL video of them cooking a steak. They well, said, why would we animate that? Let's just... What say we just fry some shit up. <laughs> Agreed. We ought to give ourselves a chance to recover ere we continue on our journey. And that's a scrap of that. There's bigger pieces of meat too that I have yet to cook. Vim to tackle the day ahead. Come, we've much to be getting on with. Ready to forge on? Let us press on with our next objective. On to the nearest location. The soldiers delivering freight were last despite. Oh, yeah, this village. man. That's not far from here. Yeah, no, this game, like, honestly, I don't even really know what I'm high-key doing right now. You kind of just get lost in it. I think it's a pretty solid single-player game. If you're somebody who was like, man, I wish I could... I wanted to play... Uh, what's this game called? Oh, my God. I was playing it. Like, if you're somebody who wanted to play um, Baldur's Gate, but for some reason you don't like turn-based games, I think this is a solid pickup. For sure, for sure. And honestly, you're gonna lose a lot of time in it. We're here, Master. Protect the shipment! Steal yourselves! Cut the things down! Cause you can get a, you can do a lot of cool shit. Like, but I also say this, like there's no reason not to play Baldur's Gate. 
like straight up if you were to ask me which game you should get between this and Baldur's Gate I'm gonna say Baldur's Gate 10 times out of 10 but if you're somebody who wants an action RPG then this is definitely a really good one Tis done. well said I thank you for coming to our aid that was a tight spot you saved us from yeah I see it I just seen it now I didn't even peep it what luck Nary a scratch on the wares to show for it. Would you mind coming over here? Yeah, get his ass. Get his ass. Get his ass. Get his ass. What the Oh, he broke free. Yeah, yeah, get him. Get him. Miji, how we doing? What's up, Trip? What? I keep... What's up, Captain There's Trip? No one standing who might say otherwise. I'm chilling, man, chilling, enjoying this game. Enjoying this game. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. Oh, this way? Say less, shawty. What you doing over there, Zangief? Be careful. We have found a material. I'm sure. Oh, my God. You're in need of Yo, she got chomp. Where are they at? But this is what I'm talking about. Like, with lock on, I can lock on. Damn. Yeah. Well done, master. Other than walking into half, yo, the worst, ain't it? And I don't know, like, I understand people are like upset about the fast travel. I don't, I don't really hear. Like, you see what I'm saying? Like, every time I'm walking around, I find shit to do. And if I'm ever really pressed for time, I feel like I just take an ox cart and I'll get there, you know? At least, like, right now, once you, exp I'm like exploring the map and then I un unlock the cities and I just take an ox cart to where I need to go. And from my understanding, there's also fast travel, like, uh, waypoints or something like that that get unlocked later in the game, too. So, again, like, I get it, but I also just don't, like, get it. You feel me? Like, I think some of the criticism is valid, but I feel like a lot of the people who are complaining about fast travel weren't even playing the game. You know what I'm saying? Like, they didn't even, they didn't even buy the game. Y'all fighting over there? You know? Th yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, people said that. Oh, no. Yeah, beat it. Yeah, beat his ass. Come on. Don't track it. Lost your nerve. Break your back. Hey, baby. Where you going? Oh, nice. What happened? Okay. Well, be careful. Love you, baby. How do you unlock the different ox carts? Why should only be between two cities? I only need fast travel when I'm about to die or need to recover my health somewhere. Is there a way of unlocking ox carts? Or is it just like going to the places and talking to the people? Or like, do you need to take like a specific... Do they have specific routes? Like, they'd be like, yo, we're heading in... What happened to the, what happened to the quest? 
Did the quest... At once, master. Oh, you gotta talk to the people in the town. Oh, okay. That's valid. I'll gather this. It might be of use. Oh, my mom just sent me a message. Oh, I gotta pick my mom up from work, so. Gotta make sure my whip don't smell like the hashish, you feel me? Yeah, no, I think I think it definitely right, could. But I also think like comparative to other NPC systems, like the thing I like about Dragon's Dogma is that I feel like their NPCs actually feel like their NPCs don't feel like accessories to you. They feel like their own individual person, if that makes sense. I don't have to sit there and be like Hey man, I need you to come fight this guy over here. Please, I need you to come fight this guy over here. This guy's fighting me. I need you to go go hit that guy. Go hit that guy. Like these dudes are like, yo, I'm gonna pop the spells. I'm a I'm a buff you. I'm gonna heal you. I'm gonna do whatever needs to get done. Whereas like other games, <coughs> mm. other games are like, yo, I'm a I'm a be there and do passive damage. But if you really want me to get in there and get get it going. I'm a, I'm gonna need you to tell me who to fight. Yeah, no facts. And it's not the same thing over and over again. to the next location. Oh, there's a chest up there. On to the nearest location. How do you even we get were it? to make the half village, as I recall. It is not far from here. I cannot hold your power. Yon chest is in a place not easily accessed. It is a vexing thing to see it so plainly and yet be unable to open it. Oh, you know what? I, I got an idea. 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 Very well. I shall return. No. No, that didn't work. I thought I could do that. <laughs> mm. 
Nah, it's not gonna work. Uh. Oh my bad, brother. We've been traveling together for some time now, haven't we? As a result, we move as one. I wish I could climb. Oh well. These with the these. I enjoy watching these games more than like playing them. I feel that. Yeah, brother. It's it's clean, it's pretty clean. Like the game is like it's pretty clean. Onward. Our work is not yet done. Shall I lead you to the location nearest here, Arisen? We were to make the half village as I have. It is not far from here. Alright, cool. So I got another hour and a half left before I gotta leave the crib. I gotta grab my mom. Alright. That's a big dude. Follow me if you would. Yeah. Originally, I don't even know. I don't even know if I was gonna do rogue. Like I started this game. Another statue. Like randomly. Will yield us all to view. I don't know how to delete my I save. See no reason like I, I started it off stream because I wanted to try it out. I just wanted to see if the game would run right. And then like I didn't I didn't know how to delete it, so I was just like, fuck it, we're gonna rock out with this. You can change your vocation, but I kind of just stayed. I kind of just stayed a. Uh, a thief. Let us press on with our next objective. All right, we're like at midday right now. On to the nearest location. Something like that, yeah. We were to make the half village as I Yeah, or I'm sure if I Googled it, it's not like if I Googled it, it I would find it. I just have it because I was like, you know what? I'm fine with being a rogue because I wanted to be able to climb on people and jump off of people and shit like that. Like the play style is still fun as hell. But the next time we get a chance to make a character, I gotta make a female character because I feel like I don't make enough female characters when I play games. Oh, you're gonna get hit with this rock, bro. Actually, you're gonna hit, hit with your boy. I will finish this here and now. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I wanted to make a woman, and I was like, damn. I guess I'm gonna just gonna have to rock out with uh, Ice Cube's son. Cause that's what my character looks my like. My knowledge from other worlds tells me that a forgotten riftstone lies near here. Shall I lead the way? How do you tell people to do that? You have no need of my assistance at present, but I shall be ready to render aid at a moment's notice. When they be saying like, "Yo, I want you to," can you do? Can you? I I know of X Y Z. I just have to press go again. Get your ass down here. Oh, okay. This whole time they be saying shit and I'd be like, whatever. I'm like, do it or don't. Pray, follow me. Now I know. Now I know. Next time it happens. I'm also going to try not to get s caught up at all the, by all the side shit too.
And by side shit, I don't mean side quests. I mean like just side shit. There's a big health bar. Oh, it's a pig. My game crashed. Oh. Uh, or it froze at least. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Yeah, it's only bad. This is the only negative about this game I have is just on PC. This game runs awful. We got what? How many hours? That was like two and a half. Those two hours of the game before it crashed. So, you know, not not unbearable. Still get some good sessions in. Okay. Yeah, not unbearable. You can still get some good sessions in, but be crashing that's something to be aware of it be crashing all right let me open it back up i'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick All right, we're back. <sighs> I've been trying to get to this monster threat for like the past two hours. Onward. Our work is not yet done. Unless you have any objections arisen, I will plot our course from the nearest location. We were to make for Harv Village, as I recall. It is not far from here. That doesn't sound... That doesn't sound safe. That sounds quite concerning. Flame will accomplish little against this foe. Oh, flame will accomplish little.
I heard flame and I'm like, ooh, and then he was like, will not be good. I'm like, damn. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. No harm in picking a few. It must be quite difficult being like a Trounstower foe, well and true. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take it must be difficult being like a pacifist in this world because like there's literally goblins every ten feet. So it's like damn, you have to fight and kill. Look there. I aspire another statue. I can foresee no reason not to go see it up close. Where's the statue? I suppose there can be no harm in bringing this along. We can What's up, turtle? Gleaming treasures round every corner. How you living, gang? Ah, I sustain is yours to wield. Oh! No, get your ass over here. Oh! Well said. Oh! Stay with me. Wait right there. What is that noise? Our ranks have gone unchanged for a while. As a result, we move as one. Oh my god, it's a zombie. Okay. That was a lot. I didn't know we had zombies in this game. Yeah, I found some zombies. Um, crazy. Also, they said something about a statue. I don't see a statue. Proceed to the next location. Shall I lead you to the location nearest here, Arisen? Yes, ma'am. We were to make for Harv Village, as I recall. It is not far from here. I think it's like right over here. I think it's this village right here.
Yeah, so this is like the uh, the menu if you want to like grab a different um, pawn from somebody. A troubling rumor has reached my ears, and methinks I ought to share it. Tis said there is an illness pawns can contract beyond the rift that inflicts unspeakable harm on those around them. As it progresses. The pawn gradually loses all self-control and, in time, will even cease to heed the Arisen's commands. How terrible. We shall have to be alert to the signs of this sickness among our number. How do I feel about the game? Pretty good. It's a pretty good game, can I lie? Pretty fun. We will be home. Would you mind coming over here? Honestly, worth the money. Like a solid oh, triple A, triple A title. To a dangerous place. Scared beast. Game of the year. Game. We've been dispatched to call them. A small force ventured inside, though I've seen neither hide nor hair of them since. Seems the battle is hard won. Maybe. No, then turtle. When I tell you that the microtransactions are. are Microtransactions with the crashes. Yeah, like well, the the optimization is bad. The optimization is Wind bad. It, master. Um, if we're talking about like the microtransactions, how do I put this? If I got the microtransactions would be like if I got mad at like a pizza place charging for extra toppings. I've made this analogy and I'm sticking with it. I genuinely don't think it's as bad as people make it out to seem. It's one of those like, if you want extra shit, sure. This gloom. No few times has an overconfident step soaked my boots. Fine. There's a haze over my eyes. Can anyone hear me? We need help. I don't want to fall here. God. Damn lizard. Alright. Well I cannot see. Yeah, like if I, like I think I think it's very much over. Uh, what's the word for it? I am in your debt, sir. Thanks to your valor, I shall live to fight another day. Over here, if you please. I think them boys be Tis be complaining about nothing. It might be beyond our reach. I'm I'm all over there. Yeah. Um, for in Tekken though, on some real shit, on the realest of shit. This is my first time clapping eyes on such an item. I expect my own master has yet to even discover it. Damn. I would hate for my pawn to be talking shit about me behind me, behind my back. On some real shit, I'm next time we play Tekken, I'm playing on the right side. So if you're like, yo, when let's let's lab. 
and you're like, damn, this motherfucker sucks worse than normal. It's because your boy is not laughing. More of these to hand, or to serve us well, it's, not, it's because your boy is on the wrong side. That's what she said. When and how we put them to use. But I need to, I need to get better on the other side, bro. Because like, when I tell you a side switch can literally call the game for me. Like if it's if it's two rounds, right? Final round, game point, game on the line. When on right side. We're not, we're, we're not, we're not clutching that up. You don't want any more? It's good. Hmm? What is it? Oh, not bad. Oh, it's spicy. Hmm. Love you. I gotta pick up my mom in like 30, in like at twelve thirty. I have to pick my mom up. Um, yeah, if you don't mind, it's not that big a deal though. That was good. It's a bond me for those wondering. But yeah, no, I need to. I just need to work on my right side, bro, because it's so bad. And I, honestly, like, cannot cannot see sometimes. Like, I think I was playing a, a match, and I'm like, bro. And what's crazy is that, like, the people I play against, it's not like they're better on the wrong side. It's the fact that, like, it's not that they're better on the wrong side. It's the fact that they use the same cheese, no matter the side, and I fall prey to it. Would you aid me in reaching the entrance? It is done. Splendid. I'm gonna go back to town, drop this man off, and then pick up and like drop some stuff off in the in the inventory because golly. Yeah, I got him on second. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Heal me. Heal me. Heal me, please! Yeah, why not? Uh, I didn't want to use it, but I really didn't want to stop and go back to where I last saved. Damn help if you need a mage healing. I didn't know that. that was 
hard one. What fails to destroy us? I did not know that. The man, that man only plays Smash as a fighting game. I wouldn't even really. That's a platform fighter, but I and I used to be like I think it's I think I think it's still a fighting game, but like transitioning from Smash to any other fighting game is so fucking difficult. Why was it spicy? What's up there? I can't make much out from here, but I have a feeling it will be worth the climb. I want to explore this cave, but. Like I spam, like no spam, smash. I played smash and then played Tekken after. Oh, it's not bad though. It's actually a pretty good play. You went in there to save my fellow soldiers. I underestimated you, friend. You've done well this day. I thank you. We'll see to the. What will be? I like the bread better than the the other plays. Hold, sir. I'd rethink pressing onward if I were you. Forgive me. I didn't mean to startle you. Hmm. You're we were hoping to reclaim our village. We fled when the dragon attacked some days past, thinking we'd return once the baleful thing was. I like gone. the beef from the other spot too. When I ate this beef, like I was like, hmm, you know? Easier said than done, clearly. In our absence, what are we to do? The guards not ah, oh, but mayhap they needn't at all. Please, sir, do something. Saurians are bound, master. Be on your guard. Careful now. But I, I played Smash and then I, I went from Smash to Tekken. I will say this though, I wasn't like deep into Smash when I switched. And even when I switched, I wasn't deep into Tekken either. Like I played a bit, I just, I just started playing Tekken. They are, but one thing I will say one thing I will say, Tekken's like combos, the way you do it in rhythm is kind of similar to Smash where like sometimes it's not frame perfect. Sometimes it's about like timing it correctly. You feel what I'm saying? Is the deed done? We shall all be able to return to our homes at last. I dare say we'll have this place livable again ere long. I cannot thank you enough. If you happen to pass by, I should like for you to see this place as twas afore the dragon's attack. With this, the power but has passed. very different world. Still, perhaps we ought to visit the village again anon, just to be certain. Right, you are. Yeah, like it's just like it's not about like in Street Fighter. It's like oh, I got I I got a hit confirm. Let me just spam out the whole thing, or let me like do the whole combo. In this, it's more like you know what I'm saying. Like you, you get the vibe. You catch the vibe. You know you know what I'm saying. I'm happy for him though because like i like smash but man i feel bad for the smash players because i feel like learning smash is like learning it's like learning a language that nobody but a specific country uses it's a cool skill to have but it doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things It's like, but like, that ass though. It's like, yo, I'm rich in Prussian francs. It's like nobody takes that currency, except for the people who take the currency. Agreed. We ought to give ourselves a chance to recover ere we continue on our journey. Like, what what language do you speak? Hieroglyphics. Oh, that's sick. That's a that's a sick skill to have. It's not going to help you in anything else, though. Whereas, like, oh, do you play Street Fighter? 
Like, yeah, I play Street Fighter. Oh, cool. Where's the village? Oh, there it is. I'm like, where's the village? It's like, when you're playing Street Fighter, it's like, oh, I know how to speak Spanish. It's like, oh, okay. That doesn't mean you can speak fluent Italian, but some words literally mean the same thing. And you understand how this, how this shit works. Sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. What the? What the thing? Thank God. Back to the cave. Back to the cave. Back to the cave. Yeah. Cause I, I really do think once once we once we as a society give up on Smash being a fighting game, like they're gonna they're they're gonna move forward in a in a different direction. And honestly, it might be a better direction. Not better as in like better for the community who plays Smash Bros. It will never be better for you guys. But better for the people but better for the game itself. Like they'll be like, yo, we're gonna add shit that makes it more fun for the people who don't wanna play it competitively. But they also know that like if they moved completely away from the model that they have nobody's playing that shit i think nintendo just needs to like hey. Shall we proceed into the i think nintendo just needs to like Narrow like passages may await us. just be like straight up yo be your guard. we don't want this to be a fighting game it's not supposed to be competitive we're gonna make this super wacky and unplayable competitively but even then People will still play Smash competitively. But also Nintendo knows that if they move away too far away from what Smash is at its core, which is a fighting game, uh, they're going to lose a lot of money. They're trying to find like the perfect medium of like getting money from the people who play Smash every single day and the concept they want it to be. Yeah, but they know, and that's the thing like they, they want to embrace the party nature but they also know that if they do so, they're going to alienate the fans that make them all their money. Put it in the next Jackbox, you're hilarious. Yeah, and that's and that's what I'm that I agree with you. Like no matter what, even if everybody had the same move set, people would still play that shit. What's that noise? I don't like that it's getting more consistent the closer I get in here. Aught appears to have changed since we were last here. Let us proceed with due caution. What could be the cause? Who? This demands further investigation. You freaks! That was scary. Yeah. Smash will always sell consoles. And I don't think they'll ever really change too much in the formula. Like they they know they know what makes them money. Yeah. I think I was talking to Ken. I think a while back I was talking to Ken. I was like, because we were talking about something and he was like, I would love to play Smash competitively, but like, I don't want to play on that online. And I told him like, bro, I would love to teach you what I know about competitive Smash. Damn, did I forget my water bottle? I'm a fucking dickhead, bro. No water. Dick. Ugh. Mmm. <laughs> put ba put bathing in the user agreement clause and that that takes care of most of the player base and not talking to minors that's crazy but facts though 
But I was I remember telling Ken, like, bro, I would love to teach you Smash, but I'm not playing online either. Like, the only way you can really enjoy Smash is if you got people who, pl who play offline around you. Like, you can't, you really can't play that game online. It's like, it's awful. Even the homie, even my friend who used to play it competitively, like, he would go to events. He would be at, he'd be, he'd be at the locals would tell me shit like yeah we used to play we used to practice online because i remember when i was there the homies would what's this looking like we used to we used to uh this shit looks crazy kind of hype though um Nah, bro, it's really bad. It's not toxic. It's awful. It's just like, you know how like you don't accept Wi-Fi in Tekken? Like, think about the worst Wi-Fi you've played against in Tekken, right? That Wi-Fi is not, like, think about the worst one. Think about the worst Wi-Fi session you've had in Tekken, right? The worst, like the absolute worst one that you've played all the way through. Not that it got disconnected. Like it, you went all the way to the end. And you're probably like, wow, I never want to see that again. In Smash, that's like the median. Like, that's like regular. It's that, that's how bad it is. It's not toxic. It's just bad. The, the online is bad. So when you try to play competitively, you really can't because you're just moving at three frames a second. And on top of that, you know how like, Oh man, I hate fighting Hua Rang because Hua Rang's annoying, or I hate fighting Reyna because Reyna is annoying. Imagine fighting a laggy Ness or a laggy Lucas. Like, there are characters in Smash that make annoying Tekken characters look like godsend. If I had to fight between, like, Steve, Steve is a good one too. If I had to fight against a good Steve or a good Hua Rang, I'd fight 20,000 good Hua Rangs than an online Steve with bad internet. Like that shit is, it's, it's that bad. But when you play it, when you play it locally, you're having a ball, bro. You're having fun, you're talking shit. I hear Kazuya's annoying and special. He is, but he's not worse than Steve. Like the, the, what they, the, the abilities they gave Steve in this game make that character like absurd. Kazuya's annoying as shit. And he, some would say he's even broken. But compared to Steve, nah. Steve quite literally can make platforms. In a platform fighter, this man can quite literally make platforms. You know what I'm saying? Think about that for a second. Think of, th like, think about that for a second. Like, imagine a character in Tekken who, like, you know how, like, you use your heat gauge and you think about it and you're like, oh, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a hold on to my heat gauge or I can do whatever. Imagine a character that, like, can actively generate another heat bar just because he walked like he walked away from you and he generated another heat bar you're like what the fuck and that's not even that's not even like a good comparison either because heat in tekken is important but it's not it's not game breaking a platform that shit's game breaking nor and normally i don't even really, like i personally don't think i'm a, and i'm gonna keep this shit a stack i'm gonna keep this shit a stack bundle with y'all I am not for banning characters in fighting games. I am very much against it. I understand why they do it for Steve, but I'm very much against it. And I will say this, I still stand by the sentiment that the, the characters in fighting games should not be banned. But I am also of the sentiment that you should just not play Smash anymore because that shit's that broken. That's how I feel. Like, I don't think they should ban Steve. I think they should just ban Smash. Like, yeah, I think y'all should just pick up something else. It's just not worth it. But if y'all ban him, I understand why y'all ban him. Because that character is really, it's kind of nuts. And I don't even, and that's not even like, that's not even the worst, all the parts that are about Steve that are annoying. Because even if you took away the fact that he can build platforms, like, his kit is still stupid nasty. He's got a crazy kit. But again, honestly speaking, when Nintendo is making these games, they're not sitting there thinking like, they're not sitting there like, oh man, I hope, I hope that the people pick up Steve and they lab him for 73 million hours. They're picking them, they're making these characters with the intent of like, 
Yo, that kid who plays Minecraft is gonna be so fucking happy. Like that that's what their their mind is thinking. And they're thinking like, hey, I wanna make a I want I want the people who play Minecraft to feel like they're playing Minecraft. The same way the people who play Kazuya are feel like they're playing Tekken. Like I want that. And I get it. Like I get it, bro. But when people are playing this game competitively, like you can't have that. Like the closest thing I could equate to to Steve in Smash is imagine Akuma if he never got nerfed. Like it's a character that fundamentally breaks your game because he's doing shit that nobody else really can do. And then but you you have no support from the devs, so like the character is just always going to be this broken. Like that's the best example I could give you is is what a broken Akuma. Your pack, master? I may need to leave this this tap this uh cave soon because I might have to go say what's up. I have to go pick up my mom. Um, aged fish. Yeah, fit, fuck this fish and discard this too. I'm really just about to search them. Yeah, like Akuma. Like, yeah, yeah, like basically regular Akuma. Or like, imagine Akuma, but stronger. Like, it's fucking OD. But again, they're not designing it with the intent. They're not designing them with the intent of like, hey. We want this character to be really, really strong competitively. They're kind of just like, yo, we want to put Minecraft Steve in the game. Yo, what if he could do Minecraft Steve shit? Oh, that'd be sick. Like, honestly, it sucks that Nick All-Star Brawl didn't pick up the way I wanted it to. Because that game is kind of fun. But it really didn't pick up the way I wanted it to. And I think it's just because the community as a whole just is like... They'll sync with that ship. They'll sync with that ship. We could... The Smash community could be on a, on a Titanic level ship, right? With Oh, we made it to the front. Oh, we we explored the cave. Look at us. An Honestly, that's fun. Fairy stone. Impressive. Such a thing escapes my master's notice entirely. I need somebody to catch me when I go down there. Whoop. All right, Ash. Geronimo, bitch. You fucking sucks. Anyways. Um. Also, if you're if you guys didn't know, your pawns, if they're below you when you jump from a big height, they will catch you. Um. But what was I saying? Like, you could put all the Smash players on a boat, right? That's sinking. And there could be another boat that has a better version of the game they enjoy with like funding with the possibility of turning this one game that you play into a career and they will look you dead in your face and be like it's not made by nintendo therefore it's not important and that's the sad part because i'm sure all those 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 smash players that could quite literally go pro in any other game because i'm not saying the skills are transferable but there are people who i've seen lab smash and learn smash that can learn any other fighting game if they went to play those fighting games they, they don't want to because they're just like it's not smash and i get it i get it but it's also like how how long how long can you complain about something before before you're just like man maybe i'm the problem Like it's just sad, you know. My I interest you in my humble I didn't know I had this. But again, like it sucks, but it's like, man. What can you do? You can lead a horse to water, but you quite literally cannot make them drink from it. 
and I only want the best for the community. Like I only want the best for all gaming communities. But there's just certain shit like we all gotta kind of come come around and agree on. Like this shit is kind of ass. And this doesn't even just go for certain games. Like this is like there's a lot of games out there that we all play, and we're just like, why do I? Why am I? Like selling my soul for this you know why am i spending all this time on it like another example apex are these daggers better than mine i don't think they are i love apex i love apex to death I loved Apex, I should say. Not I love it. I loved Apex. But Where's... you get to a to point where the game is not fun, unbalanced, like the microtransactions. Like I, I still don't understand why people are super pissed about the microtransactions in Dragon's Dogma, which have nothing to do with the base game. But we're we have not but we have stopped talking about the microtransactions in fucking Apex. That's the shit that be blowing me. Is like you'll see the same people who are making these think pieces on why it's not fair that a jail key is 50 cents in the game shop. Why are they selling jail keys? And then they'll be like, I just got the fucking death box skin in Apex. Like, what are we talking about? Like and heirlooms, the sad thing is, is that they created heirlooms. I don't know if they're the ones who created it, but they popularized it. And now we're seeing the same type of nasty microtransactions in heirlooms in other games. If you play League of Legends, you know what I'm talking about. There are chromas for your legendary skins that are sick. These chromas could literally be their own skins and people would pay for them. You have to buy packs to get them. The same way you have to buy packs to get an heirloom. And you have to spend upwards of 200 to 300 dollars just to get guaranteed a skin it's nasty that's what apex has left us with if the apex dies tomorrow the only thing that we're going to be left with is heirlooms in other games that's their legacy think about that same way the same way overwatch's legacy is loot boxes and they're not the first they're just the most they're just the most popular ones to do it they're not the first like Fortnite, we think of Fortnite, we think of battle passes, but they're not even the first ones who have done a battle pass, I don't believe. I believe like it's, and I could be wrong, but double check my, somebody double check my research. I'm pretty sure they're not the first ones to do it. I think it started with like H1Z1. And that's what's like, that's, but we're, we're complaining about shit like diversity and we're complaining about shit like fucking uh, little microtransactions that you can ignore. Uh, but that's my TED talk on the subject. Uh, no heirloom? I bought an heirloom too. I'm not even gonna lie to you because I had a job and at the time I was playing Apex Heavy. I bought one of them bad boys. I was just like, fuck it. I think I bought uh, Ramparts because I liked Ramparts. I think Ramparts, I don't like the character, but I, well, not like, I don't, I, I love the concept of the character. I don't like really playing the character, but when I saw the heirloom, I'm like, this is like the best heirloom for this character. Fuse getting an electric guitar. I wish I would have had that one, but I'm not going back to Apex. Unless they, unless, nah, I don't think I'm going back to Apex. Like, there's just really no shot. Like, I think, I always, th and I think about it all the time because I really want to play a shooter, but like, going back to Apex, brother, that's a lot. That's a lot. Like, I'd, I'd go back for, like, a gun game, maybe a team deathmatch, but honestly, I'd rather play 30, 40 minutes of Helldivers by myself, play a mission, get, like, a couple medals, work on my medal battle pass or whatever. I'll play the finals, but even the final, the thing I hate about the finals is that they really fucking use, uh, the finals really uses AI voice acting, and I think that shit is so buns. That's, like, my main issue with the finals. Is like, I would love to play that shit all the time. But I hate the fact that they do that shit. That's why I don't think I'd, I don't think I'd, I'd put it on stream anymore. If I played it, I play it with y'all. I probably wouldn't buy that battle pass or nothing like that. Yeah, the the voice acting for the for the announcer is AI. Like that's AI. And isn't it? It's the laziest shit too. 
like imagine imagine being like hey because it's funny because they talked about it they tweeted about it they tweeted about it and they said hey um we used ai because sometimes it takes too long to to get a, a voice actor to send us some lines so you know in in the in the just to make things faster for ourselves we and we used ai so that we don't have to keep asking a voice actor to do to, to work they, essentially they said we don't want to keep asking a voice actor because it's not fast enough for us and then a voice actor quote retweeted it and he says every voice actor in the industry at this point has professional equipment at their homes on top of that i'm typing this tweet out i am halfway through my he's like he's like i'm typing this tweet out today i've recorded for three different games in one session like it only i and i did all of this in just one day it is not a time thing we work really quickly our turnaround time is faster than most it's not a thing about timing it's really you don't want to hire them and there are no time constraints what are the time constraints for the finals what do, you don't even really need them to record a lot of lines you know what i'm saying like they'd be saying the same shit it'd be like the kingmakers be the kingmakers are taking a you can't get somebody to say that shit for you or do y'all not want to write scripts like just get the fucking like it's not hard it's not hard at all it's not like they be they don't be giving you play by plays they really be saying like they have deposited the money the king the the trendsetters are taking b like it's <clears throat> you know what i'm saying bro and then that that one lady will say some shit and she'll be like what a powerful play and the guy will be like taking a like y'all are just liars don't lie to me don't don't sit here and lie to me i'm right here i'm seeing you And all that for what, bro? That's, and that's the main reason I don't really play that game too often. Will I play it? No, sure. I, I download it again. I don't really care. But it's definitely not a game that I really want to keep in the rotation. Because, like, that right there kind of tells me enough about the, the, the creators. I'm kind of just like, whatever. Yeah, I got it, I guess. But, yeah, shooters are kind of cooked. Overwatch is cooked. That shit is pretty cheeks. They canceled the PvE again. Which is funny, because they canceled it the first time. And then they, they brought it back, and then they canceled it the second time. Why are you playing with me? Why are you playing with me? That's like your ex coming back to you and being like, oh, I'm a changed man. And then you find out he's cheating again. And it's like, well, it's not the same, but, you know, I, it's just been hard. Like, why are you wasting my time? Keep it a stack. Just keep it a stack. Don't tease me. Why are you bringing Clay into this? But that ass, though, it's like, my father, my father cheated. My father, my father didn't have PVE maps. You know how hard it was for my father to not have PVE maps? How am I supposed to have PVE, PVE maps? Like, it's so annoying, bro. Just keep it a stack. Just, just, just tell us, you know, you don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Okay, that's fine. We will criticize you, though. But they're like, they're like we don't want to do it, but they don't want to get yelled at. And I get it, because gamers are nasty. We... I don't want to say we because I don't even I don't really even be like I don't even follow devs half the time. They said the Overwatch fandom was 10 years of oh the story about to pick up. Nah, but that ass though. It's the biggest like Overwatch feels like like Derrick Rose. It's like at one point we were like, this is gonna be generational. Or like Ben Simmons. Like, yo, not even Ben Simmons, because Ben Simmons would have been like if it was hype in beta and then died shortly after. But it's like, yo, this is going to be the greatest shit we've ever seen in our lives. And then it just, it just wasn't. Bro, it's so awful. And it's those goddamn cinematics, bro. It's those goddamn cinematics. I, wanna, I wish I could, if I was, like, I wish I could fucking take, I wish I could just, like, put a law into place that was like you are not allowed to use cinematic cutscenes or cinematic trailers to promote your game i feel like that would be that would destroy so much marketing it's not even funny so many games would lose significant amount of money or you can only publish cinematic cut cinematic trailers after the game is a, after the game is released 
Like, imagine if you would have played Overwatch and then you saw all the cinematics after that. You'd have been like, oh, cool. Like, it would have worked in Overwatch's case, but think about, like, The Division. Like, no, nah, league, league cinematics are fucking... I still need to do a league stream where we watch all the cinematics because those cinematics are fucking gorgeous. But then you play league and it's just like, click, 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 click. Oh man, I died from a misclick. And then it's like racial slur, racial slur, racial slur, people wishing death on you. Uh, forfeit at 15. Like that's, that's, that's what the legal, that's the League of Legends experience. That's why I, I can only play with like, I, I can only play unless I'm playing with somebody. And even then, if it's just two of us, it is quite literally a very short session because that shit will be awful, awful, awful. Like you could be playing okay, like you're, you're, you're chilling in your, in your lane doing the best you can. And then it's like, <laughs> then it's just like, wow, you suck. It's like, what did I do? I haven't died. I haven't done anything. He's like, you suck because you didn't help me win my lane. I lost and it's your fault. Like, and you're sitting there thinking to yourself, like, no way. Like, that's so common. It's not even funny. Like, that's actually, like, so common in League. Someone wished a plane would fall in my house in League? Bro, I'm not surprised. That motherfucker sounds like a nice person compared to some of the people that I fucking played League in. Reminds you of Tekken? Nah. No, 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 no no, 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 I don't think you understand pockets. No, 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 I don't think you understand pockets. I, I, like, when I shit, I shit you not, it's like, it's like, imagine if Martino, at least hateful league comment, imagine if Martino lost rank, right? Like, let's say he lost his, 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 his game, right? He lost his game of, of Tekken, and Lex is in the other room, playing apex and he and martina walked into the room and he said yo it's your fucking fault and then proceeds to give her for 15 minutes the biggest fucking like most vile speech known to man because you can't leave you can't leave until the first 15 minutes of the game you can't surrender so you're stuck in this in this in this house with this person for 15 minutes verbally abusing you because they sucked. And when I tell you, average Tuesday night to be honest, you're crazy. <laughs> like when I tell you, when I tell you that like you wanna, and like when, when I tell you the league game that Martino lost wasn't because like the other person was better. Martino was quite literally just running forward and getting hit. Like that was Martino's whole goal in that fight was that he lost it because he kept running forward and not blocking. And then it's Lex's fault who's all the way in another room, not even paying attention to what Martino is doing. And then you got to sit there, and Mar now what Martino will do is he will be yelling from across the room, doing the same bullshit that got him into this problem in the first place. And then sometimes, and now imagine, imagine that's going on, right? Imagine that's going on, and God forbid Martino queued up with his daughter, because now his daughter is also fucking blaming you. So now you got two people talking shit about you when you haven't even done a fucking thing. And you're like, wow, it's only four minutes into the game. I got a nice 11 minutes of verbal abuse left in me. You know what I'm like? This is League of Legends. That's League of Legends. I'm sorry to tell y'all. Because now you got two people yelling at you when they're, the, when they're the problem. And instead of being like, and instead of Martino being like, damn, Luna, why didn't you help me? Why didn't you help me fight this fight? They'll be like, nah, let's just blame Lex. <laughs> like, I, as somebody who played League, who plays League still to this day, I can tell you, even in Overwatch, it's not as bad. Because Overwatch, you, you'll be in a game in Overwatch for 15 minutes, but that's the whole game. You want to know what the feeling is like when you get blamed by three teammates for something they did, and then 15 minutes comes up, and you click, and you click, hey, I want to surrender, and they say no? Because some they will hold you hostage and be like, we're not surrendering, we're going to let, we're, they've, and I, I promise you, they will say this shit in the chat, like verbatim, they will be like, no, we're not surrendering because you fucking suck. So you're going to sit here and however long it takes them on the other team to beat us, however long it takes them is how long it's, you're going to be in this game for. And you can leave. You can, if you want to leave the game, you can leave the game. 
but the problem is you're gonna get you're gonna get penalized and you're gonna be banned for 15 for five minutes before you can play another game of league why do i play this pockets because when i sit I'm, i can i can sit here and tell you this right now no game has given me the satisfaction of a competitive game the way winning a game of league gets you there's no game that feels as satisfying as winning a game of League of Legends. There's nothing, nothing has to come close to it. It is quite literally a drug. Like it gets, it's so fucking fun when you're winning or sometimes even when you're losing, if you're losing with the right people, it's the most fun you'll ever fucking have. But it is quite literally, it's it like, I shit you not, if it wasn't for the community, yeah, it, it, and it's just the community. Cause it, the, the problem is, is that like, I play with my friends, if we lose, we get off the game. We take like there's times if you've been in my if you've been in my Discord when we be playing League, you know if we had a bad game because nobody's fucking talking. Nobody's fucking talking. Or you know we're having a blast because we're fucking crying. We're laughing our asses off. And that's the difference, man. That's that's the that's the problem with League. Is that like it's just like it's such a really good fun game when you're winning or when you're playing with the right people. But you're playing that's why but the, the problem is that the community is so fucking mentally destroyed because the game just just puts you in the most annoying toxic relationships for 45 minutes with some of the most brain dead people in the world who think you're wrong the i'm gonna say this last story and then i'm probably gonna hop off stream but this this encapsulates the league of legends mentality bro I played one game of I played a game of rank with my brother. I play ranked every now and then. I I don't take that shit serious whatsoever. But I play if you're somebody who's like I I need some people to play ranked with. I always am like I able to I'm always come through and help out. Bro, me and my brother were winning. Me and my brother were winning. Okay. Um me and my brother were winning our lane. We were crushing it. And the lanes, there's three lanes in the game, and then there's two people in one lane, and one person's called a jungler. Their role is essentially to take objectives and to sometimes help people in their role. So in my lane, we were winning so much, the jungler helped the top lane because nobody else really needed help but him, right? So everybody starts winning their lanes. <clears throat> we take the first tower, which is a good objective. Like, it's really good to, you take a tower, like, that's, very very important like kudos to you 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 did some cool shit like that's a, very important in the game um we took the objective too fast for the person in our top lane that's right we were winning too fast for the homie because we because him and the jungler kept the jungler kept going up there and killing his opponent making him behind on gold making him behind on experience so for the next because the enemy team surrendered thank god for the next 10 minutes of him being in the game, I had to hear this man bitch and moan about the fact that we kept winning too quickly. Yeah, and you're like, why would that matter? Because in his eyes, when we took that tower, he is now, now he has to push up further, which he doesn't. He doesn't know that because he sucks. He has to push up further to be able to farm. He doesn't know about pushing. He doesn't know any fucking, he doesn't, he was stupid. He's stupid. Like, it was a stupid, like, he's just, he quite literally is dumb. As somebody who plays that lane, I promise you, you don't have to push anything. You just have to not, you just have to not fucking attack everything you see. That's all you have to do. If you don't attack everything you see, you can farm from your tower. It's very easy. And this man was like, because this person wants to come up here, like, He's like, because this person wants to come up here, now, I, now I'm unsafe. And it's like, no, you still ha you have a tower. You didn't lose your tower. You took his tower. You have, you have a safe place to, re to, to retreat to. And that's the type of mentality is because we're not even, not because we're winning, it's because we're not winning the way he wants to win. We ended up winning that game. And this motherfucker was in the chat uh, arg talking with like the enemy team, talking about some like, the jungler ruined my game plan or some bullshit like that. Like, think about that shit. These motherfuckers just lost because they're getting dicked. And now you're over here trying to get sympathy from the people that just lost. Like, shut up. Anyways, don't play League of Legends. It's quite literally a drug and I would not wish it on the, my worst enemy. But if you end up do playing League of Legends, let me know. Because uh, I be playing that shit all the time with my girlfriend.
But thank you guys so much for kicking it with me. I really appreciate y'all. I'm going to catch you guys. I think Panda's streaming tomorrow, so check out for that. Um, I'm probably going to stream on uh, Friday, so fingers crossed. I'll see you guys. We're going to see what happens on Friday. We might play a little bit of Like a Dragon. We might play some Tekken. I might play a little bit of Tekken, but I think we're going to do Like a Dragon first. And if we, are, if we stop Like a Dragon because we switch characters or some bullshit like that, then we'll swap to Tekken for a little bit because I'm, I'm trying to play on the right side. But appreciate you guys. Uh, I'm going to catch you guys next time. Make sure you follow the Twitter for more uh, content. Make sure you follow the, the YouTube. Make sure you follow the Twitch. But Wotaku, out.